to the story we brought you earlier this week about a $4,400 tip. Two Bentonville waitresses received it while on the job. Since then, one of the waitresses no longer works at the restaurant. Five News reporter Michael Wilson is in Bentonville. He spoke with that waitress and the restaurant asking why she no longer works there. Former Oven and Tap server Ryan Brent says the last eight days have been emotional. We are tipping a total of 4000 <laughs> That's Ryan Monday tearing up after receiving a $2,200 tip in cash. I was definitely like just shocked and overwhelmed with joy and gratitude in that moment as soon as I realized what he was saying. Business owner Grant Wise presented that massive tip to Ryan and a co-worker. 30 minutes later, Ryan says she was told she can only keep 20% of the tip, splitting it with the rest of the oven and tap staff. To turn right back around and find out that I wasn't keeping it was kind of disheartening because we don't tip share in any way. Oven and Tap tells me otherwise, sending five news a statement reading in part, the server who was terminated was not let go because she chose to keep the tip money. The restaurant also says tip sharing is a common industry practice. It follows. Ryan messaged the tippers about what happened and they came back to take the money. Later, giving it to Ryan, but then Tuesday morning came. They fired me from Oven and Tap over the phone and I've been there for three and a half years. So that was also like really heartbreaking. Especially when I didn't think that I did anything wrong. Oven and tap confirming with five news Ryan is no longer employed there. The statement we received says in part oven and tap does not deliver terminations lightly because we value our employees and highly respect their privacy. We never discuss personnel issues. The server who was terminated several days after the group dined with us was not let go because she chose to keep the tip money. The restaurant says the other waitress who received the tip is still employed at the restaurant. In Bentonville, covering news where you live, Mike Wilson, 5 News. We have the restaurant's full statement on our website at 5newsonline.com.